<sighs> I think it's about time. Let's just get in first. Let's check. Um, Tara? Tara? Um, she's okay. She must be in the food court then. Or the, or the cafeteria, whatever. Yeah, there she is. Okay. <sighs> I think it's about time that I tell her the truth about where I'm really from and about my people. Um, hey, Tara. Um, I apologize about that. Um, I was on watch duty most of last night with Anton, so I'm a bit tired. But, um, anyway, I, I wanted to, to talk to you. Um, uh, yeah, I, I just, I just wanted to talk to you. So, the greenhouse is coming along well? Um, yeah, it sure is. I mean, I want it, I, ju I just want to get it done before it snows, you know, because it's definitely cold enough, so I'm kind of expecting it. The way you're going, I'm sure it'll be done soon. You really know how to keep people going, to keep them under control. That seems like a leader quality to me. <laughs> Thanks. So, what's your big project? What are you turning cell block C into? Oh, um... Yeah, um, a sort of better living quarters, I guess. Alright, any reason for that? Um, I'm afraid I haven't told you the complete truth, Tara. And what does that mean exactly? It means that I've hidden something from you. What? I've told you that it's just been Anton, Travis, and I. But that's not true. So what, you're part of a bigger group? Uh, a much larger group. A group that I was in fact the leader of. You were a leader of a group. I, I mean, that explains how you can keep en everything under control, but a whole group? A whole community? Um, I mean, the community had at least 40 or more people, maybe a little less. But... but why are you why are you on your own, then? We, we got attacked. And my people went to another community. You were in contact with another community? No, I've, with about five other communities, actually. Oh, so why didn't you go with them? I, I needed to seek help. I didn't feel fit to lead them. And now that Ellie is helping you, you're going to go back to your people? No, actually. I think I'm going to bring them here. I mean, you're one of my people now, so... You're going to bring 40 people here? Well, I mean, I mean some of them. You know, some people will probably want to stay in the other community. For the past few years, I've only see the, seen the same few faces. Now that I'm about to meet 40 new people, I honestly don't know how to feel. Then I suppose you should feel happy, right? I mean, they're good people. Families, women, children, you know, all, all, all kinds of people. Whoa, you don't have any pets, do you? <laughs> um, yeah, actually. We have a few dogs, I mean, horses, pigs, cows, a penguin, and a panther. I was joking, but oh my god, the only dog I've seen recently is Sparky, Rob's dog. Did... Wait, 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 did you say penguin and panther, or, or was that just me getting confused? Uh, no, that, you, you heard right. You rescued a penguin and a panther. Actually, my friend saved the panther. I saved the penguins because, you know, I, I just love penguins. Ah, I see. So, when do you plan on bringing them here? I, I mean, it depends. There's still quite a few things that I want to sort out first. You know, like the greenhouse and things like that. And the air conditioning, the heating, and a few other things, so yeah, I, I completely understand. Exactly. And plus, I want to make sure that everything and everywhere is as safe as possible for the kids. 
and one of my friends is or was pregnant too because she's probably given birth by now so you'll be bringing a baby here uh hopefully yeah i mean that's that's exactly why everything needs to be safe you should have told me sooner i'd have made sure we got all the help we needed especially if you're bringing children here i just i had to make sure we could trust each other i mean it's a hard thing to do and in the past i've been a bit too trusting and it's only gone and messed things up for myself and my people i'm glad we can trust each other so let's get things underway let me just finish up here and i'll head on out and help with the greenhouse okay all right yeah i'll i'll meet you out there and um i'm sorry for not telling you sooner but i'm glad that you understand okay i'll see you outside in a bit i need to go speak to anton anyway see if he needs a break and then i'll um i'll speak to you in a bit Okay, let's come on outside, right, so, oh, not, we're doing quite well, we've only got a few more bits to do, and then we've got the plants and whatever, but definitely seems like it may snow, and Ellie, hey, Lily as well, and where's is Travis, yeah, Travis is there as well, hey, right, okay, let's go speak to Anton, I'm gonna go and ask him, I mean, he's, he doesn't seem to leave this post, I mean, I keep going to talk to him, and quite frankly, it's a bit strange sometimes, because he doesn't talk much, but I don't... He's just been stood here. I mean, from the moment we've got here, he just... He just stands there, watching guard. I mean, there are other things he can do. I mean, we've got a gate, we've got walls, so... I'm going to ask if he needs... He'll say no, but you never know. Hey, Shay. Um, right, okay, everything's looking clear. Um, hey, Anton. Oh, hey, Ryan. Uh, hey. Um, do, do you want to take a break? No. I like standing guard. If there's walkers, I want to make sure I can see them. Um, okay, I suppose that's fair enough. Let me know if you want a break. Will do. Also, I like your haircut. How'd, how'd you manage to do that? Oh, um, yeah, I completely forgot that I have a man bun now. It's a bit weird, but... It's bit gonna take some getting used to. Lily thought it'd suit me, so I don't know. It's just what she did, but Lily did it. Um, you should talk to her. Um, maybe get yourself a haircut. I mean, ever since I've, for as long as I've known you, you've had long hair, so maybe you can get a cut or something. I'm not sure. I've had long hair for so long, and that's even more of a reason to have a change, right? I'll think about it. I kind of like having a long fringe, though. I mean, you can keep your fringe, right? I mean, just style up the rest of it or something. I suppose so. I'll definitely think about it. Uh, cool. I look forward to seeing your new hairstyle. Wait, I, I haven't decided if I'm getting it cut yet or not. Anton, I'm pretty sure you have. I mean, you said you like my haircut, and then... Yeah, I'm pretty sure you've made up your mind. You seem to do that quite often, have your mind set before you even do anything, so... I know. Okay, I look forward to seeing it. <laughs> you can already tell. Anton's one of those people, kind of similar to me, that... Once they think of something they have their mind set on, they just do it. Whether they regret it in the, in the end or not, but... <sighs> yeah, I, I'm looking forward to seeing his haircut and um do you guys yeah they need some help okay right okay i've got this end all right all right yeah right so what we're going to want to do you're going to want to carry it over we're going to have to cut this up a little bit so whoever's got the axe it's going to be your job and, oh sorry about that um right yeah so let's just lift these up carry them over and then we'll just start cutting and then we'll See where it goes from there, okay? This I want to get this greenhouse done by today because I've got a feeling that we're going to wake up tomorrow to at least a little bit of snow on the ground. So, let's get this up. Okay, right, ready? On the count of three, we're going to lift, okay? And three. Oh, well, hold on, hold on. Right, okay, let me just check that everything... Right, we need to sort of push this out of the way. Let's make sure that the logs are tied because I don't really want them falling apart, okay? Right, give me a second, let me just make sure, okay, this is tied, that's tightened, okay. 
It's weird, because my dad actually taught, well, he didn't teach me this, but he sort of, I watched him do it once, and I sort of just picked it up. Okay, so that's tight. Let me <clears throat> push that out of the way a little bit so there's a little bit more room. Okay, on the count of three, ready? L on the count of three, lift, right? I just want to make my shelf, make myself, I said my shelf. Well, I suppose we could make this into shelves, but anyway, on, um, you know, I want to make myself clear. And saying my shelf doesn't really help with that, but on the count of three, you're gonna lift. Okay, ready? Three. I, I, I. I'm sorry. Okay, that was really weird. I said on the count of three, and then I counted down from three. But yeah, on the count of three. Okay, one, two, three, lift. <laughs> 